Hey everybody, Coffee and Chaos here, and welcome to episode 3 of the Dune Spice Wars Harkonnen playthrough. Had to think about what I was going to say there. So, where we left off... Oh, hit the right button. We were expanding way off to the west here. Grabbed several towns, so we secured the Great Volcano, getting a whole lot more fuel production, as well as... Oh, what is this called? Red Cliff, which is Oalasek. Um, that is also going to give us more fuel cell. We secured another spice field, and we secured the rare elements here for our processing plant. So, a lot of money, a lot of fuel cells, a lot of spice, getting a little bit of everything that we need. And I'm thinking that our next move is going to be to head over to Cartpo here. Now, one thing I do need to take a quick peek at, there is a mission and it is Defense Sabotage. So, lower attack power for the target main base, higher damage received by the target main base, reduces power and increases damage received by the main base of the target faction. Boom. We want to go ahead and prep that. We already have combat drugs prepped. And I think we'll go ahead and prep a supply drop. The whole idea being... I want all three of these ready to go so we can take Cartpo and then when we're ready we will jump straight into Siege Tabur, 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 damn it, I don't know how to say that, and go for the attack and try and take them out of the game early. That's the plan, whether it will work, Listening. I don't know. Agreed. How hard could it be? Let's get couple militia, two ranged militia, and a demo. Defend our territory here. Did we do the same thing on these? Yes, we did. So we should be pretty well defended, in theory. Ready for destruction. I would like to get... Ooh, you know... Trying to decide... Oh, what do we have here? Alright, they're withdrawing automatically. Let's get a stealth probe. Just for kicks and giggles. See how that works. Alright, those are ready. An active harvester, go ahead and deploy now. Point of interest is done. Resolve that. Wasn't there another one? Yes. Oh yeah, any military stuff that we look at now. What are we actually researching right now? Oh, not a damn thing. Okay, let's make sure we go for... What is this? Lower Solari upkeep, lower military... Military unit Solari cost. One more agent to Chome infiltration. Go for advanced engineering. Actually, ooh, hang on. Think about this for a moment. Plus two salary per fuel spare per spare fuel cell. And we get 20% more fuel cells. That wouldn't be bad. It's a little extra cash. How much Solari are we spending on upkeep for military? Uh, recruitment office, recruitment center... Where does it show... Armies, 55. So it would take, what, 10, 15 away? That wouldn't be bad. It's a lot of time going into this. 
we could also reduce our water upkeep. Agents assigned on Arrakis Infiltration produce more authority. Well, authority is the biggest thing slowing us down, isn't it? Oh, we could go for water sellers and then water trade. You know what? Let's do that. We'll secure as much water as possible and do it that way. All right, let's go ahead and unpause. Ready for destruction. And we've got a ton in our stockpile. You know what? I'm going to go back down to like 10%. Let's sell everything we got and make some money. Uh, we got another council vote. Speaker of the council. What will that do? Oh, decline. Chome Spice Exchange. Oh, let's do that. Yeah, everything towards the Chome Spice Exchange. 30% boost to uh, our overall income would be great. Listening. So, we need 276 authority before we can go after Cart Poe. We're currently at 116, so we got to sit for just a minute longer. I could go ahead and attack now, but it might be in range of the Siege, and I really don't want to get hit. They might have uh, missile launchers that they could launch at us. Let's go ahead and redeploy you. Ah, uh, what else can I do at the moment? You know, the Atreides are pretty quiet, aren't they? Yeah, they're slowly bulking up on hegemony. I might need to go in and slow them down at some point. But overall, I'm feeling like we're ahead. I'm not too upset by how we're playing so far. I'm going to go ahead and fast forward. This is the point where I can really fast forward quite a bit. So I think I'll just go ahead and bump the speed up for a while. We can pause if we have to. Got a point of interest done. Let's go ahead and start working on expansion development. Let's get to business. They give me money, I give them Plascrete. Okay, I can deal with that. That means I can get some more vanguards. I could get another house guard. How about another gunner? Another trooper. And that'll be my military. And we can actually support that, can't we? Uh, maybe not. Whoops. Should have thought about that a little bit more, shouldn't I? We're probably going to tank our manpower. Actually, not too bad. Just keep moving everybody over there. Imperial tax has been paid. And we'll drop you over here as well. We're up to 225 authority. Again, we need 276. Starting to get there. About 40 to go. You know what? Hell 
I think it's time. Move out. This is the biggest army I've had in the game so far. And that's pretty impressive. Go ahead and slow it down now that we are on the attack. Grab this point of interest. I want to pause for just a moment. Check out those ruins. And let's watch our attack. Not a damn thing they can do. Absolutely decimated. Sandworm detected, but we're all right. So we're about five points away. Let's go ahead and fast forward. Capture. Jeez. Five spice fields. That's insane. So now we're in a great position that we can go ahead and attack the siege. Point of interest is done. Uh, wow. Are there any others? Store to find or get authority. Nah, don't want to do either of those. Same thing. Economic development? Let's do that. Deploy him with automatic recall. Damn. Multiple sandworms. Everybody deploy it again. Uh, we can get a wind trap here, get some water. And here at Cartpo, let's go ahead and get a recruitment office. And we'll get some militia. So we have some basic defenses. I think I could get a missile launcher here as well. We've got an unassigned agent. Um, you know what? I want to start working towards getting atomics. So I need a third one on the spacing guild. So I'm going to need two across the board with a third one on Spacing Guild and a third one on Arrakis. So I need one, two, three more agents. It's going to be 30 minutes to my next agent. Alright, I'm going to make that my goal though. Before the end of the game, I want to drop some Atomics. I think that's a worthy goal. Now, can we get a Missile Battery in range? Yes, we can. Ooh, 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 ooh. And I think we can get two of them. So two missile batteries prepared to take the siege.
Missile battery done. Let's get the second one. That's going to put us in a deficit for manpower. But you know what? I don't really care. We've got plenty back up. And we can go ahead and hit Siege Tabor. Sandstorm. That's Darude. Investigate the crash. Construction complete. All right. I think we're ready to go. Let's move. Once we're in the territory, defense sabotage, go. Let's wait a minute before we do supply drops. So, question is, do they have a military, and if so, will they be able to make it back here in time? Uh, we're putting a hurting on them. Let's pause for a second. I want to go back in here. Crap another supply drop. And let's prep another defense sabotage. I might have to do it a second time. Awaiting order. On it. Let's move the ornithopter up. I want to see what else is around. You know, so far... I think we're going to get it. And I don't think there's a damn thing they can do. I keep expecting some worm riders to come up, but uh haven't seen them yet. Point of interest is complete. We're a minute from having supply drop and defense sabotage again. Let's drop both operations. Pause for a second. And we'll get those queued up one more time. Ooh, I don't have enough for another defense sabotage, but I think this is enough to go ahead and finish off the siege. All of our men are getting their health back. Probably going to lose the Vanguard. Uh, can I deploy you yet? Yes. Not long now. And <laughs> that's it. The Fremen are out of the game. Wow. Uh, What's our next step? Didn't expect that to be that easy. Huh. Well, I don't think I need the missile battery. Let's move these guys back to Kartpo. Um, wow. Yes, well, that was easy. That. What's here in uh, Peller?
Well, now that we've done that, I think we might have to come back around and head after the Atreides. If we take out Arwan, what does he have here? Anron, he has missile battery, recruitment office, fuel cells, wind trap. So just kind of support stuff there. Yeah, R1 is a big hub. If we hit that, that'll hurt his spice production, and I don't think he'll be able to make his taxes. What do you need, Baron? Let's take a peek at Cartpo really quick. Oops, got just a little bit of FPS drop there. I think I'll go ahead and drop an airfield. We can redeploy the harvester. All right, we have a Landsrad vote. No, I don't want the Atreides to have that. Yeah, we need to block that with everything we got. All right. That's the Lands Right Council. We've got an attack on the way. Missile batteries doing their thing. Oh no! We must have had a couple attacks here and I wasn't watching. Uh, Zanny does not have much left. Yeah, in fact, I don't think I'm going to be able to get them back. Uh, Alright, let's send our forces to Sabfir. We'll use the airfield here. This one's going to take too long to build. Right? Yeah, it's going to take too long. More worm sign to run from. I gotta tell you, with five spice fields, um, getting enough spice to meet the taxes is kind of a joke. It's quite a bit easier. We're here for you. My first playthrough, I had quite a few struggles. Now it feels like I have a much stronger understanding of how to play this. I could probably play this game on hard now. Now watch, I say that and I could go for a hard playthrough and absolutely get wrecked. Go for siege detection. Ooh. There's more expansion development there. These points of interest are actually pretty useful. So, what's going on over here at Zani? Yeah, weren't able to do anything about it. So, let's go ahead and drop our forces there. And we might be able to block them from flipping the town. Get our transports over. Sandworm detected. Okay, good. We do have automatic recall. Everybody move. Let's get rid of these raiders. Easy peasy. Sandworms. Feels like we got sandworms coming up every two seconds, but it's all different parts of the map now that we have five harvesters. So it's to be expected. Blood humping. Knives out. Baron. 
Oh, right, we're not actually in airfield range. Uh, let's move south. Yeah, we got the troops on the way. Let's go ahead and get another ranged militia. We'll add to the village. Can I build anything else? I could build another missile battery. It hurt my manpower. Hey, there we go. Let's get a recruitment office there. And a missile battery here. Since they seem to keep attacking. Perfect. What's our next step? And all of our troops can go up to Burha. Trying to decide, am I going to go for Aneron or Erewhon? Uh, probably. A oh, I guess it's Aneron. A Y N R O N. They've got the missile battery there. If we were to go ahead and hit them, it'll weaken Erewhon. What will it take to annex? Three hundred eight. You'll take two ninety two. No, let's go for Arwan first because Spice Field. We're ready, Baron. Ready for. All right, moving out. It really is a pretty game. Some people weren't a fan of the art style, but honestly, I like it. I cannot wait for this to be multiplayer. Just the antics. Worm sign. Mine. Uh, let's go ahead and do a supply drop. Good. Stupid missiles. You know, screw that. We'll keep someone there to capture. Ah! And the rest of you can move over here. And we'll siege it down. In fact, we'll do a raid. That's what we need to do. We're the Harkonnens. We raid. We pillage. Forget your missile launcher. Oh, that's a worm. Oh, boy. Yeah. Okay, we're good. And... Pillage. Take all of your stuff and things. Thank you very much. And we'll do the same thing over here to Kelanim. In fact, we might just go boom, boom, boom all the way across. Our lives belong to you. Uh, let's go over to espionage. I would like to get the supply drop. Let's unlock the defense sabotage so we have that prepared and ready to go. And... Oh, we finished water trade. That's right, we were doing these two. Let's go ahead and do instill fear. Because this one is going to reduce the cost to annex a village by doing what we've just done. 
deploy that. We're about to pay our Imperial tax. However, I don't think that 10% is going to be enough for us to keep paying that over and over again. I think we've slowed down the Atreides. The village is already unusable, but you know what? We'll take down all their buildings. Because screw you guys. Uh, let's see. Arawan here. Building its harvester back. Let's get... Two heavy militia, two ranged militia, demo, great. Alright, good enough. Let's get out of here. We'll need to let these guys heal up. So let's give him just a minute here. Alternatively, I've not seen an army from them. Oh look, we have a single trooper. Baron. Listening. Not a very impressive showing. Wait, what is that? Oh gosh! Whoa! Did you just completely explode? A little bit of a graphical lag there, I don't know what that was about, but... <laughs> Fun seeing the entire mountain explode. Go ahead and add a crew and deploy you, and auto recall is on. Alright, everybody, move out. We'll hit Kalanim. Have I lost one of my vanguards? Uh, yes I have. Oh, that's worm sign. And we can go ahead and pillage. Keep attacking everything. Ready for destruction. A strategic move. We hold instruments of doom. Any moment now, that'll be done. Ah, they got a missile battery again. Bastards. And they've got troops. Ooh, they've got a big force being built up here. So they might actually put up a fight to begin with. God knows the Fremen didn't. We took them out easily.
go ahead and deploy our harvesters again. There we go. So we'll have to hit this town. After that, I think we can go straight to Arakeen. You know, I think I'm going to discard the combat drugs because I don't want to take damage. I will go to Espionage and I will get Gear Sabotage. Because that right there... Uh, reduces enemy unit power. So we'll keep ourselves alive, we'll reduce their damage... And then we'll hit the fort. So, probably our best bet. Let's go after this. Everybody's healed up. Let's go. And while I'm at it, let's get another Vanguard? Or Stealth Probes. Two units of Stealth Probes. Why not? I'd love to use them if I can, see what they're like. Ooh, worm sign. Ooh. So right now we're actually increasing the cost by pillaging. That's interesting. Point of interest done. Great. There's another one. Ah, there's one. Siege detected. What do you do? You give me manpower. Excellent. I'll trade water for manpower. That sounds great. What do you need? So where's our drones? There they are. Take you and we'll move you right there. To Burha. Gather everybody at Air One, and then we'll move on Arakeen. How can I help? You know, if we take out the Atreides, I don't think it'll be a very hard push for us to take out. Well, nah, Siege Tuak is actually pretty far away. Speaking of, hello. Um, we got a little bit of lag again in game. Come on now. Urgh. That is a big force that came out of nowhere. And I was not fully expecting that. I don't want to... I really don't want to stop. I could withdraw my troops to try and defend. But I think that would actually be a mistake. First things first, I'm going to make sure that I have enough stockpile to pay the Imperial tax. I'm not actually going to go to the extreme. Lose 100 per minute while stockpiling 147. Yeah, let's do that. We're, ready, Baron. We're going to get everybody here. Move our combat drones up. So where's the siege? Oh, we already did that. Construction possible in base. Let's get a command post. We're ready, Baron. Why are they playing Ring Around the Rosie? Now, 
Yeah. What can you do? Ready for battle. Let's move right in. Kill them all. They're gonna kind of hook around. Everybody spread out. Let's go ahead and get the supply drops started. Gonna go to espionage. Queue up another one. Keep our health up. I really want to focus their units down. Actually, yeah, hit them. Alright, everybody hit Arakeen. Defense Sabotage is up. We're gaining supply, we're gaining health. Next supply drop is on the way. Thing. We'll queue it up. Ta da! And I'm not going to be able to afford another defense sabotage. I think we'll have enough damage to take them down. I'm just going to go ahead and fast forward for a minute. Lost a village. They finally took Kofbu. But we can take that back. I'm actually not too worried about that. Let's hit this combat drone. this first, actually. You can go after them. Oh, we actually took all the armor off the town. Yeah, gunners are awesome. Taking away all that armor. Fantastic. You can go ahead and chase that heavy weapon squad. And with that, I think we're about to take down Arakeen. Is that the Atreides? Greetings. <laughs> They're trying to trade with me. Nope. That is two factions down. Ooh. Whoa, big explosion. Well, that returns quite a few towns to neutral. And now I think that we can spend the rest of our time slowly working our way back to take back the Well of Riches, and we can just work all the way across and take down the smugglers. Ooh, that's Worm Sign. Oh gosh, did we lose? <gasps> oh no! I saw a Worm. We just lost a bunch of units. Oh no! Ah, uh, get rid of this military base. Um, Do you need us? 
I'll send you guys back to Burra. Oh, that's a sandworm there, too. Crap. Worms everywhere, man. Do we have enough for the attacks? Yes, we do. Let's do 50-50. Get some money back. And in a minute here... Will you? Alright, so... Zanny should be able to defend themselves. Ooh, they have Lancerad guards. Yeah, they're pushing a little too aggressively. I'm not a fan of this. We need to get back to Burra. And... We need some units. How do we want to do this? Well, what do we have left? We've got... A gunner, two troopers, two house guards, a vanguard. You know, I think I want... That'll bring four vanguards and another gunner. They're going for an unlot, aren't they? We are waiting. We need to get ready to grab these quickly. Oof, we're losing a lot of plascrete. What's wrong with what's wrong with our income here? Something's wrong. Oh, plascrete upkeep. That would do it. Okay. So someone hit us with that. We are waiting. Blood pumping. Got him. And we'll drop right there. Sandworm over there too. Let's deploy you. And surprise! Send the vanguard here. Trooper there. Stealth probes can focus him. Yeah, you're not taking my town. I'm going to take out your entire army. I'm waiting target. Move them up as fast as possible. Man, there is stuff to do all over the map. Speaking of... Listening. Let's move you Copy over that. here. Move you over here. Resolve that. We're ready, Baron. And Nunlot is back. We'll do that. Let's get our units back towards our base. Anything. An active harvester will send that out again. Uh, oh, we finished Instill Fear. Excellent. Now what are we going to do? Um, you know, I think we need... We've got to go for economy somehow. Plascrete production. That would help. You know what? Let's go all the way to Martial Economy, and after that, we'll grab Energy Markets. That works. Go ahead and deploy you again. I'm waiting target. Anything for you, Baron. Yep, 
Yeah, I really need cough boo back. Yes. Do you need us? Heal faster, damn you. Alright, let's go. Well, we're only losing 2.1 now, so that helps. We have Plascrete there. Let's boost our water. The Plascrete factory there as well. That wouldn't hurt. You know what? Let the probes go. Maybe they'll get killed and I'll do a whole bunch more damage. Ready for violence. And we'll capture that back for a fraction of what it should cost. You know what, Ornithopters, put you back on Auto Recon. There's more stuff popping up, so you can at least check it all out. Ready for destruction. We will do it for you. Stop attacking. Give me my town back. You know, with that, we're not quite to an hour, but I think after we get this town back, we might go ahead and end this episode, and then in episode four, we could finish off the game by finishing off the smugglers. That might be the way to go. Also, it wouldn't hurt if I restarted the game, because I think I've got a small memory leak. Probably just one of those things that happens with a new game. Uh, let's go ahead and fast forward through this. I don't know what determines the amount of time it takes to capture a village. It might depend on the number of buildings that are there, but some villages seem to take much, much longer. And this is a village with five buildings, so that might be the case. Any moment now. I kind of wish there was a timer somewhere for how long it's going to take. Like, right above would be perfect. Got it. Ready for destruction. Okay, having all of these... I think our next target is going to be Grimama. We hold instruments of doom. I don't think there's a reason to wait, so let's go ahead and push for it. Might be a good way to finish off the episode. Not to mention, another spice field. I honestly figured that this game was going to take quite a bit longer. Can we get another military building here? 
Oh, actually, yes. That'll complete our military stuff. And we can boost our Solari production. Research center and maybe a harvester works? No, harvester works and recycling vats. That would actually be the best way to go. Let's resolve that. Check that out. Hey, we got it! Damn, that was fast. You know, we're looking at 56 minutes for this episode. I think I'm just going to push for it. We'll make this a long episode. We're just going to push the entire way. I think I think you guys can tell that we're just going to kick the snot out of these dudes. So we'll fast forward our way through the rest of this game and finish this first playthrough. But I'm quite satisfied with how this ended up going. Do they have an airfield there? They do not. Nothing there. I think we can go for Haytar. Ramama has spice silos. That's actually really nice. Detected another siege. Trade some water to them for... What are they giving us? Knowledge. Excellent. Point of interest complete. Mm. Another abandoned camp. Let's move north. Go directly to Haytar. And we'll get some militia. Heavy militia, demo, ranged. Let's go ahead and deploy our harvesters again. You know, we can just liberate these. Yeah, in fact, I think I'll go to espionage, grab a supply drop. That way we can keep our lives... Oh, we can actually take control of this one. You know what? Cancel that. Cancel that. Why is it up to 452? Do what now? Special region. Two sixty three for own villages. Three seventy five for own villages. Why is that one so expensive? Because, damn it, if there was one spot I really wanted, it's this one. Maybe I do liberate that one and this one I take control of. We'll just go with it. We just need a jumping stone to get our, uh, jumping stone? Is that the word I'm looking for? Stepping stone, stepping stone. Man, I had a brain fart there. It's definitely way too late. But yeah, we just need a stepping stone to actually work our way over to the siege. Yeah. 
He's got an airfield here. That would actually be really nice to grab. Let our authority go. You'll cost me 342. Ooh, we're at a deficit for fuel cells. Need to fix that. Uh, let's go ahead and add a... Where is it? Fuel cell factory right there. Go ahead and add a Plasgreet factory there. Do a wind trap. We're a little low on everything. Go ahead and attack Holnet. We're making killer progress. You know, I think I do want to go to espionage really quick. Let's put you there. You generate more intel. Damn, you know, the one thing I wanted to do before the end of the game is atomics. 500 intel. Okay, let's actually think about this. So we need two... We need a third slot here. So we need lay of the land. Let's check our text really quick. Ah, there it is. All right, screw it. We're going to go for lay of the land. You know what? I think I will actually end this here. I was going to try and make it long, but I really want to see what atomics are like in the game. So we're going to go ahead and end this episode. Uh, be sure to go ahead and like if you enjoyed this content. Subscribe if you want to see more. Comment uh, what you want to see next for our second playthrough of this game. And I will see you guys in the next episode and final episode of this first playthrough. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.